What to do YouTube? All right, man. As you guys can see the title of this video, I went ahead and got a TV mount. I'm about to go ahead and mount a 75 inch flat screen QLED to this wall. So if you want to see how I do it, stay tuned and continue watching. The mount that I purchased is the Sanus Advanced Tilt Mount, which can hold up to 150 pounds. I went ahead and picked this up at Best Buy. You can either get it at Walmart or Best Buy, your local TV store. But I'll put the link in the description down below. All right, you guys, I did measure from one end to the other, which is 179 inches, and that's gonna give me 89 and a half inches. So now I'm gonna go ahead and get my tape, and I'm gonna go ahead and line it back up. Then I'm gonna get my template, because it does come with a template. So basically what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna find the dead center, okay? And then what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna put my tape right here. I'm gonna measure the TV to see the height and, you know, the length of it so that way I can make sure it's it's even out and it's not slanted or anything like that but you do also want to make sure you do mount this TV in the beam okay the beams are always going to be more likely random from the outlet and they're going to always be 16 inches apart if the builder did a good job so as you guys can see I got the template now it's not fully measured I got it just up there for right now so what I'm going to do is I got my measuring tape on the bottom so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go from 89 and a half and I'm gonna go straight up. These little triangle grooves right here is gonna be my center. So this is obviously, you know, an indication that this is your center. So you can't mess this up. So for demonstration purposes, I'm gonna go ahead and show you. You see how I got the tape right there. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna run the tape all the way up straight and I'm gonna make sure that it's centered. Now you guys, I don't usually do this, but this is for you know, demonstration purposes only. So that way, if you're a first timer, I'm showing you how to do it right the first time. Okay, you guys, um, as you guys maybe can see, what I did was I took a little drill bit and I went ahead and drilled inside to make sure that I was actually hitting the stud before I actually put this big bolt in. So usually, I did this for demonstration purposes only, okay? So usually, if you don't hit a stud, you see that? You see how it just freely just goes in? Okay, now watch this. See that? That's a stud. So if your drill bit, don't, just drill just a little bit, okay? Because sheetrock is not that thick. So just drill just a little bit and go ahead and try to like push and see if this drill will move. If it's stiff, that means you hit a, hit a stud, and that means you're ready to put your bolts in and your bracket. But I would recommend hand tightening it. So if you're using a power drill, take your time. Don't strip the bolt, not the bolt, don't strip the inside of the wood, okay? Because you want it to have a real good bite. So if you take your time, take your time, I will demonstrate that so that way, you know, it actually has more of a better hold. So as you guys can see, I already got my two bolts in. I went ahead and measured to make sure they're both even. So I gotta make sure I have 17 right here and I got 17 right there. Always wanna double check that before you start tightening anything down. tighten all these down then I'll be right back now I went ahead and got those bolts hand tightened down you don't want to tighten it too much because you don't want to strip it you don't want to strip the wood so you always want to make sure you hand tighten and never use a drill but with this, I'm about to go ahead and make a hole right here to run the wires through down so that way you don't see them. All right, you guys, I went ahead and installed the thing for the wires. As you can see, it's running down. So once the TV is up, you won't see those wires. So let's go ahead and start mounting the TV. So as you guys can see, I went ahead and got the TV mounted. So this is exactly how it looked. 
Don't mind the paint on the side. I'm not finished painting, but that's literally how it looks. We'll step back. You know, tell me what you guys think. Step back. Go ahead and show you up close. As far as you guys can see, everything is in there good. All right, you guys, that's gonna wrap it up for this video. I hope you liked it. If you're confident enough, as long as you take your time, measure everything, you will have no problems, but always make sure a TV this size, you always make sure the bolts are in the stud. I know they come with drywall, little grommets, but make sure you mount it straight to the stud, okay? You won't have no problems. All right, peace.